So we really appreciate, you know, all of kind of the knowledge and, and some of the the push from home assistance team as well to make sure that we apply certain standards to to those parts of the product. So that was that's been great. And yeah, um, I just love the approach by the whole home assistant team is really what the product is, which is let's all work together to create this amazing ecosystem that is user friendly and make it more accessible. I like that they uh, really emphasize accessibility and making sure that it's not some sort of a niche product for people that are highly technical. They really want to make it, you know, a product for the people. And so we're, we're super happy to be part of this journey. And I think that Z-Wave is, is going to help them just make more hardware available to, to people as they grow their, their smart homes. So it's been nothing but great, very easy, very pleasant. And I just say like, none of this would be possible, like without the commercial, well, not commercial side, but the, the business side of home assistant that was created since, you know, Nabucasa came around, right? Like people supporting yeah. Nabucasa. Could you imagine Agnes trying to like do all of your back and forward with someone that's doing this, like for, for like as in their spare time yeah. for an open source yeah. project, right? Yeah, absolutely. You get the benefits of a, an organization that is an actual business and company without the yeah. red tape of a big corporation, right? We work in technology, so we want to make sure that we move quickly enough and get things done without uh, focusing too much on, you know, business or profits or kind of like the corporate side, right? Yeah. And, and they're small enough too, where it's like, you can reach out to whoever, right? If this was some other, like a massive conglomerate, it's like, you can't just go talk to their CEO. You can't just, you know, do all that. And 